how's it going everybody it's gorilla man here and in today's video guys we're doing something a little bit different um we are going to be playing plane mechanic simulator so uh, i'm just branching off a little bit seeing if you guys like some of this content this is my first time ever even loading the game up so i mean we'll find out how it goes but it's plane mechanics so it's pretty much just working on planes instead of cars guys i think it'll be uh i think it'll be really really fun once i figure out how to play uh, but here is what hop happens right when I hop in. So it looks like they give you this clipboard and this bunch of stuff that you need to like fill out and do. So at about 15 minutes after takeoff, the engine started randomly losing power, had to turn back and land. After fixing this, please refill the aircraft for the next flight tomorrow. Oh, guys, and this is 1940s, by the way. So we are way back during World War II. So let's see. Pilot's name, Mark Whitman. Mechanic's name, Gorilla Man. There we go. All right. Uh-oh. 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 I, 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 I messed up, guys. I messed up. All right. <laughs> Let's load back in. I think I accidentally signed it, and I wasn't really supposed to. Oh, here we go. Okay. So, here we go. So, it's May 1940. Number one, Silver's Flying Training School, Nether, Never, Netheraven Airfield. So let's get straight to it. You can see in your notebook, pilot mentioned power variations. This looks like a problem to do with the fuel system. Start by opening opening the right engine cowling. Alrighty. Well then, let's get let's get cracking. Let's get working. So they said the right engine cowling. Oh, when removing parts. Oh, that is loud. You can rotate the camera with the movement keys. Okay. Scrolling the mouse wheel will let you move in closer and further. Moving the middle mouse button will focus the camera on your cursor. Oh, interesting. Okay. You can also zoom by pressing F. To go back to move controls, press the right mouse button. All right. So they say there's something wrong with the fuel here. Which part? So we got to switch to inspection to check the status of a part. Click on it and hold it for about a second. Okay. Check the carb. Oh, the carburetor's damaged. All right. Let's move the damaged carburetor. Press one to switch to disassembly mode. Okay. Got to take the. Oh, this is so much easier to take stuff apart. Alrighty, easy. Let's get the carburetor out of here. Or the, yeah, get the carb out of here. Alright. Some parts can be repaired on the spot while others need to be replaced. Go to the workbench, press space to begin repairing the damaged carburetor. Alrighty. Well, okay, so workbench. I take it this is my workbench. So, by repairing parts, you'll save f the spare ones for others, which will contribute to your overall score. This, in turn, will get you promoted sooner. Okay. Uh, to start the repair, click on one of the yellow points, so like one of these itty-bitty ones. Um, then press and hold the left mouse button to start applying oil. The goal is to release the button if the oil level is within the green zone. You can rotate the part to continue with the movement of the keys. Oh, okay, I see. Um... To complete the repair, you need three out of the four hits. Completing all four will restore the part to pristine condition. All right. So. So there's one. Oh, there it is. There's the second part. There's two. Okay, so it's like a little dial. If you guys can see that on the right-hand side. Oh, so it gets harder as you go on. Ah, we didn't get that one. So it's not pristine. But we did restore it. So install mode is button two. Get these put back in. Uh, put the carburetor intake pipe back into the engine and then close the cowling. It's kind of nice that you can just go through and screw all these 
on automatically, and then they just screw on by themselves. All right, there we go. And then close these. Uh oh, there we go. Now it's real fuel the aircraft. The fuel tank in the Tiger Moth is between the top wings. You'll need to use a ladder to get across it. Uh, go to the ladder, pick it up using space. Let's find the ladder. So it's between the wings. Really? So the. Whoa. There we go. So put the ladder near the front of the aircraft and remove the fuel cap. Don't forget to switch to disassembly mode. Alrighty, will do. Um, we'll go here. Whoa, so it's... Why would they put the fuel tank up here? That seems like a bad idea. Okay, now grab fuel hose from the Bowser, Bowser and insert into the tank, pressing space. Okay. Uh, is this the hose? This is the oil Bowser. Hose, oil. So is this the one then? Oh, there it is. So here is the hose for this. And then insert it in. All right, I don't know if it's working. <laughs> uh, do we got, I assume we gotta turn this on then. So grab the fuel hose from the Bowser, stick in, then get back to the Bowser controls and turn the valve. Okay, now that's all I have to put the hose back in Bowser and refill it, all right. Uh oh, we know we didn't wanna move that. All right, let's grab the hose here and put it away. All righty. That was uh, pretty easy. Oh, and that guy's driving away. All right. Let's, uh, let's sign this then. Does that mean we're done then? I think we're done. Oh, wait. We got to close the fuel inlet. Oh, okay, okay. Guys, I don't... Oh, no. Don't worry. I will get way faster at this the more I play. If I would stop climbing the ladder... Take the ladder. There we go. Alrighty. Let's put the fuel tank back in. Now, okay, so then right click, there we go. Good, now open the notebook on task page and sign it to end the mission. In fact, you can end the mission anytime provided they installed all the parts. Keep in mind though that not fishing tasks will have consequences. So then we'll just do G, GM, whatever. All right, got it, got it, got it. Perfect job, baby, there we go. So we get up to 500 points and we get aircraft first class. Okay, so I think as you go on, if you do really, really bad things like we did the first time, we didn't even repair anything, we just called it, we like we get demoted. Like we lose everything, which is not good. Um, as you can see here, the pilot has asked you to replace the wheels. To do this, you first need to raise the front of the aircraft. Go ahead and get the jack. All right, well, let's go find the jack. This isn't a jack, is it? No. This looks like a jack. All right, so now place it between the main wheels. There we go. And then, wait, what, then, then what do I do? And then turn the lever with your mouse. Oh, there we go, okay. Oh, I see how it works. All right, it's up in the air now. 
Now what did this say? Now remove the left wheel. I love how you just have to nick the nick the screws and then it's good. I like this game so far. I think it's really neat. Get the spindle nut off there. Alright, to replace it, just go back to the truck and fill the replacement form. Don't forget to sign it. So go to the truck. Cost and resource points. Uh, Alright, so just need one wheel. Gorilla Man, good. Now you got the wheel, put it back, and complete the rest of the assignment. So I'm pretty sure it's just going to take us through all of these one by one. So we'll learn how to place like body parts next. Um, fenders, I don't know. Engine probably coming up here soon. Alrighty. Let's grab this guy. Let's lower it real quick. Whoa, that was quick. All right, take this bad boy. Toss him back down over here. Wait, what do I need to do next? Place the both wheels. Oh, dang it. Okay. So it looks like I need to get the other wheel off of here. Let's see. So one is the removal tool we'll see if we can repair this wheel actually maybe we can I don't know if you can actually repair wheels all right let's go over here to the repair bench all right looks like we got nothing to repair so let's go replace another one then one wheel gorilla man thank you and then we need to refuel also all right get that guy off of there and then while that one's getting off screw this in Sweet. So even I've even after I walk away, that'll still continue. Alrighty. We need to fill this bad boy up. Place that back, and then we hop up here. Yep, he drives away, because he's like, all right, you got your gas. We'll lower this guy down. And then I think... I think that's it. Let's go check this. Refuel the aircraft. All right. All righty, looking good. Perfect job. I love the writing and everything in here, how it looks like authentic and realistic. All right. There's two missions, two, two tasks complete for us. I have not been kicked out of the Air Force yet. All right, so refill the oil and refill the aircraft. So refill the aircraft with new oil. This works just like refill, refueling, but you need to put oil, the oil bowser, close to the aircraft yourself. The oil inlet is behind the left cowling. All righty, let's get to it. So they said it's behind the left cowling here. Um... Oil inlet is behind the left cowling.
I am looking here, guys, and I do not see this. The left magneto, timing gears. Oil tank cap, there it is. Okay. All right, oil tank cap is off. Let's walk this bad boy over here. Uh oh, I think I trapped myself. There we go. All right, now where is this? Insert the oil hose. Remember that filling the oil above the max point where it may result in damaging. Oh no, we don't want to do that. All right, so there's your minimum and there's your maximum. Okay, so we can ramp it all the way up and then slow her down. That's not too bad, is it? All right, put it away. Then we'll push this thing back to where it needs to go, and then we'll grab the ladder, hop up there, refuel it real quick. All right, let's drop that. Hold on, let me get this done real quick, though. There we go. All right, pretty pretty simple, I'd say. I think the harder part's gonna come when I have to start memorizing what parts go in this. Oh, can I not click that from here? I don't think I'm. I don't think I'm able to get it. Here, let's move the ladder a little bit closer. There we go. Me. Yeah. Let me rotate this propeller out of our way. Ah, there we go. And I'll take the fuel hose. Crank her all the way up. fuel hose away okay I definitely can see how I can get way faster at this I already feel like I'm getting way quicker all right complete assignment look at that a couple hundred or about a hundred points on that one no it's about 50 points that's pretty good though so now we're at 136 points all right, let's see what the next mission is here, guys. I think, though, we'll probably stop here at this mission. We'll see what it is, then we'll stop. Just to see what they're going to want us to do. Refill the oil, fix problem with the oil system, and then refill it again. Oh, okay. So, there's a, pre there's a problem with the oil pressure system. All right, well, we'll fix that in the next episode, guys. Um, it's the same guy, Mark Whitman. His, uh, his tiger moth has not been... Not been treated too kindly, I guess. But yeah, we'll come, we'll pick this up in the next episode, guys. Um, if you guys are liking this series so far, leave a comment down below letting me know. Also, hitting that like button shows me that you guys like it a lot. Uh, but don't worry, we'll be doing more car mechanic simulator stuff like that. I'm just sprinkling in a little pilot or plane mechanic simulator in with it. Um, just because I've had this game for a while and I wanted to see if you guys liked it. But hey, there we go. Hopefully you guys liked it. If you did, leave a like, let me know. And I'll see you all in the next... Oh, no. And I'll see you guys in the next uh, plane mechanic simulator.